No conscription for Ireland. Let English men fight English wars. Thank you, sir. You know, we learn about the rising in school and you kind of read about these like fantastical hero figures and just doing this has made me go, God, they were just people who didn't know exactly what the outcome was going to be, were terrified at times, just knew what they believed in and um, no matter how anybody feels about the rising, um, that's a pretty incredible uh, belief to have. You should be fighting for your own country. Well, that's what we're doing, fighting for our king and country. No, you're a traitor. I love Frances. I think she's brilliant. No conscription for Ireland. You guys should be at home. You shouldn't be fighting them when it's after a war. I liked that she um, wasn't like a stereotypical, the strong woman, or she had, you know, she had, she was just a normal woman who was passionate and had some, you know, strong ideals. King, God save the king. I think that's what's really interesting about Frances' character that she has a great journey throughout that this goal and this passion and this, uh, you know, free Ireland that she's prepared to sacrifice everything for. Thank you, Francis. And uh, thank your friend. I'm glad I could play my part.